Hey, yo, what up, everybody? How you guys doing today? I am super excited today because we got a few things going on. One, Julia and I are meeting up with another TikTok couple. Their names are Joe and Angela. Not even kidding, Joe and I have been trying to meet up for like the past almost two years now. They live about two hours away. We're like North Jersey, pretty close to New York. So we're gonna take a drive there. And then later on in the day, we're all gonna be going to the American Dream Mall, which I've never been to before. If you guys remember a couple years ago, I went to the West Edmonton Mall in Canada. Canada, which is like one of the biggest malls in the entire world. It's crazy. There's an entire water park and amusement park there. So the American Dream Mall is kind of the same thing. It's just ridiculous. There's so much to do. Super excited. It's going to be my first time experience. Oh, and if you haven't noticed already, yes, I know. I have a giant blister on my lip. It's not pretty. This appeared on my lip yesterday. I haven't been feeling that great over the week. I think it's from traveling. Julie and I went to Orlando this past weekend to go to Playlist Live. Obviously, there's a ton of people. I probably ended up getting getting a little bit of a cold. Well, anyway, I didn't end up bringing my vlog camera. You guys have seen, I've gone to play this live in the past. And I feel like every time I go to this event, I just focus more on like recording rather than actually experiencing it. I did end up recording a little bit of footage. So check that out. So Julia just took a selfie and in about an hour, she's gonna have her face on a latte. It's gonna be pretty cool to check it out. Julia's gonna take a photo in here. They get all these boots set up. It's pretty cool. She's getting the photos sent to herself. Oh, cool. It turned out good. Yeah. Oh, I think he's like sculpting it himself. That's awesome. All right, it's done. Let's check it out. Oh, oh the wow. Photo. There's the photo. I tried to get the, the kissy face on there. Wow, that's that. amazing. That's crazy. Thank you. There is the finished product. All right, what are you going to do now? Drink it? I I'd hate to ruin it, but it's, it's going to get ruined eventually. I'm going to get like glitter on my lips. Yeah. Because they put some like edible glitter on them. Like I said, I didn't record a lot. Another thing that happened is, as you guys saw, my dad ended up peeling off the wrap on my BMW M4. We did get that fully peeled off now. This is what it looks like. Bam, there it is. You like it more now? Yeah, man. Yeah, less attention grabbing. The color's beautiful. Yeah, this, man, it's crazy. It hasn't been this color since I got the car. There was a front splitter, and in the splitter, it got split right in the middle. So uh, it kind of got messed up, destroyed. It's no longer on there, got it taken off. I like pulled up too close on a curb before, Cracked right in half. It does look sick. But yeah, yeah, it's back to normal now. And along with some more updates, as you guys know, my sister did have her baby. His name is Julian. She had him August 16th. It is now September 9th as I'm recording this. I still have not yet met him, guys. It's driving me insane. I want to meet him so bad. He's still in the hospital. He just had another surgery the other day. And he's supposed to get one more surgery before they are able to take him home. Yeah, about that. I'm editing the video right now. And literally as I'm editing it, my sister sends me a text saying that Julian Julian has to get four more surgeries before they can take him home. So that's all the information I have as of right now. It's sad, man. I really want to meet him. Hopefully soon. We're about to head out the door. Let me know down below in the comment section, have you ever been to the American Dream Mall? And if you have been, what is your favorite thing to do there? I feel like I'm going to be completely overwhelmed. I'm not going to know what to do. Apparently, you can even ski in this mall. Like they have like a whole mountain and everything with like fake snow. Like, dude, that's crazy. Hazel, you going to go to grandma's today? You have a friend there. <laughs> of course, we need somebody to watch Hazel for the day. So we're gonna drop Hazel off at Julia's grandmom's house. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Look at the ear. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Mr. Beast just actually opened up his Mr. Beast burger spot in the American Dream Mall as well. I've never had it yet, but I love me a good burger, so maybe we'll try it out. She's getting so big. Look at her. Hazel's 10 months old. <laughs> She's like, pick She's me up. She wants to leave. <laughs> Car ride time. <laughs> Did you bring a lint roller? Oh no, I gotta get it. Good call. Yeah, every single time we bring Hazel somewhere, she sheds all over us, so definitely need to bring a lint roller with us. It's either she's nervous or like really, really excited, and she just sheds so much more. There we go. Remember she used to be scared of this? Yeah. She's still scared? Aww. You can't run away now. <laughs> all right, bye Hazel. We'll be back in a couple hours. Let's see grandma for a day. We're dropping her off now. Julia has a lot of hair on her, as you can see. Honestly, she wiped a lot of it off already. But I actually didn't wipe any off. I think it's just the shirt. You were talking. You were wiping yourself. Oh, I guess you didn't, even realize. I didn't even realize. Yeah. That. We have black stairs in our house. And I kid you not, we'll clean the entire flight of stairs. And two days later, it's already 
full of hazel hair. I don't know why this little girl shed so much. So we just arrived here. This apartment is beautiful. There's a lot of light coming in, which is awesome. But we're here with Joe and Angela. What's funny is a lot of people online think that Julia and Angela look similar. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below. <laughs> it's literally every comment. Yeah. We both get tagged in it all the time. She even gets tagged in it saying like she looks like Julia. It's, it's really funny. I mean, they're both wearing black tank tops too right now. So we just recorded a bunch of TikToks. Of course, you can check it out on my TikTok at Lancer10 if you don't follow me already. We're gonna head over to the mall right now. Ooh, my boy got the Range Rover Sport. This thing's sweet. It's actually my first time in a Range Rover. I actually debated getting one of these. It was either this or my BMW X6M. I know we're rolling up here because uh, they got a freaking huge Ferris wheel. That is wild, dude. Here we go. Coming to this mall, I wasn't even thinking about shopping. Like, Julia brought it up this morning. Like, oh, I'll probably go to this store at this store. I'm like, oh, I just literally want to come here just to check it out because how crazy it is. Like, they got a whole water park. What is this? Nickelodeon Universe. A water park. This oh. is what we want. <laughs> Dying? Yeah, we need to get some food. What do they got on here? Coca-Cola eat. What is this? Oh, okay, dude. There's a Charlie's lot. Charlie's is so good. Are we trying the Mr. Beast burger? Are we doing that? Yeah, we should. We should try everything. <laughs> Let's see, like, what the attractions are. They got mini golf, big snow. I guess that's like the mountain where you can like ski down it. Blacklight mini golf, water park, the Dream Wheel, Lego Land, Mirror Maze. There's so much here, bro. There's an aquarium. Escape room, what? game room, a skating rink. That's I'm gonna be real, I'm kind of overwhelmed. Uh, but I guess we'll just walk around and see what we see. Giant chandelier. Where should we go? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know where to go. It's so big. I've been here before, but I've like, I've only went through like 20% of them. <laughs> Wallpaper is interesting, to say the least. This little furniture setup. They have these plants with faces wrapped around them. That one's kind of trippy. A little kissy face. And we got another one over here. This one's a hand holding an ice cream cone. Honestly, I would love to live by this just so I can come here all the time and just explore. I would come here every single day and probably find something new every day. We need our Heelys. Oh, true. Oh, at Playlist Live, they were giving out Heelys. We got them for free. Yeah. We haven't tried them out yet. I used to ride them all the time as a kid. We should have brought them. I know, we should have. Wow. This is insane. Wow. I know. They got a whole Best Buy in here. We got in the Ugg store. I want to see the color in person that I got. Yeah, Julia was looking at some Uggs online. I was like, oh, how ironic. Literally, as soon as we were driving up here, she was like ordering a pair online. These are it, but not this color. What color is it? Maybe they have it. Mustard seed? Yeah, she got this in a different color. <laughs> what? That is hilarious. <laughs> wow, these are really thick. These are even like thicker. I feel like these bottoms would light off. They look like light up shoes. Is that the one you ordered? Should I just get them here and then cancel it? Yeah, you could do that if you want them today. Like now the these look thing. wild. Yeah. I don't yeah, know if I'm a fan ugly. of that. Yeah. Oh, you okay. getting those, bro? Let me get these. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I all can right. See <laughs> there we go. If I put these on, I might be your height. <laughs> you're six four. Six four. Damn, bro. I'm like almost five eight. So, like, I don't even know if your face is in this clip. <laughs> <laughs> we just got here and I'm already purchasing. I know, for real. Oh yeah, those are cool too. I got those for my grandma, but in different colors. I like that color though. Julia has a pair of shoes that kind of look like Uggs, but I literally slide them on every morning because she leaves them by the door. So I look kind of goofy going out there all the time with like these super fluffy shoes on. It's kind of like Crocs, you can customize them. What are those? I think uh, they're rain boots. Yeah, that's a little funky looking. She remind me of like SpongeBob squeaky boots. <laughs> all right, we're coming over into the food section. A little salad bar, oh, pizza, so cheese steaks, Latin grill, Cajun grill, a Taco Bell, Popeyes, wow. There's a lot of options. They have like a falafel place. Ooh, is that haagen -Dazs? This mall is very pretty. Wow. They literally go all out here. And they have like some music playing. It almost sounds like I'm in like Jurassic World. Here's what the other side looks like. We're headed over to Mr. Beast Burger right now. Oh, I see it. And there it is. Look, they get all the signs up for it too. I know the other day I saw a video where it was like 10,000 people wrapped around this entire section. Oh, this is it. Yeah, this is cool. This is so dope. I have no idea what I want to get. What are you going to get? This is a cheeseburger. This is a cheeseburger? What's up, bro? Can I get a photo? Yeah, it's cool, bro. Let's do it. Oh, thanks. 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 Sure, thanks. Sure, thanks. So you got people streaming out there. What's up, bro? How you doing, man? You got a picture? Yeah, it's cool, bro. How you doing? Awesome. Nice to meet you. All right, we're about to order. Oh, he's got all this candy set up over there, too. I just got a normal cheeseburger. I got Chandler style, so it's two smashed crispy beef patties with seasoning and American cheese, and I added ketchup and mustard. We get a number, find our table. He's got this whole merch store here too. Now we're just gonna wait for a burger. And we can watch the stream, I guess. 
Yeah, they have someone streaming across all the monitors. A booth just opened up. A lot more room, we're gonna sit here. There we go. Oh, I think that's yours. Did you okay. get fries with yours? Um, maybe it comes with it. <laughs> oh yeah, let's go. And then, you got the grilled cheese. Thank you. He got fries on his burger. We all got something different. Oh, that looks good. So good. First bite. Yeah. Give it like an eight. She's got the Mr. Beast burger. Okay. That's good. What would you rate it? Eight. Yeah. Wow, those fries are crazy. <laughs> I've never seen somebody put pickles on fries. I love them. There's a like ketchup and mustard on it too. Yeah. Yeah. They're like these fries, but you know, all the stuff on it. You know, the fry seasoning is really good. It is. Really good. So I kind of compared this to like a McDonald's because the patties are really thin, but the buns are really thick. So it's like McDonald's with like thick buns. But I think it tastes really good. What do you guys think? Do you like it? Really good. I like it. Good. Joe said he's had it before, but he ordered it. He never came to an actual restaurant. Yeah. Is it better now? It's a lot fresher. Yeah. It's really good. I ate all of my burger. I ate a patty from Julia's burger because she took it off, so I just ate the whole patty. Um, we ate most of the fries, as you can see. The fries taste like they have Old Bay on it, sugar, and salt. It's like spicy with like a hint of sweetness, so I'm, I'm assuming there's sugar on it. It's pretty good. So overall, it was pretty good. I liked it. I really Not liked bad. it. They get a whole Stranger Things fit. I guess it's a whole like line with them. Yeah. Stitch. Whatever. And you gonna rock it? Oh, yeah. You're a little farmer girl. <laughs> For some reason, whenever I get a burger, I always like crave, crave sugar, something sweet. So we passed by a Hagen dazs over there. Right after we read out of the store, we're gonna get some ice cream. I'm, I'm hyped. I'm gonna get a smoothie. A smoothie? Because they make it with like sherbet or gelato or yeah. something, so it's like really good. Yeah, I think we had it before, it's pretty good. I'm happy that I finally tried the burger though, because it's been like a year since you know, he dropped it and I haven't tried it yet. It was really cheesy, which is not a bad thing. I liked it. I don't know how much cheese was on it, but Angela got the grilled cheese and it looked like there was like four pieces of cheese on it. Like it was stacked pretty high. Yeah. That, that was definitely probably a lot, but anytime we see a mirror, we're just like always fixing our hair. This is like a common thing. What's funny is my parents have commented on this before because we always do it. They used to do the same thing when they were younger. Like really? anytime they walk by a mirror, they're always like checking themselves out, making sure like their hair looks good or whatever. You know what's funny? It's the same thing. Yeah. I saw a comment somewhere that was like, wow, they're looking more and more alike. And I awesome. honestly see it. I know. I noticed it too the other day in a picture. I don't understand how. I don't know. Do you guys, do you guys think we look alike? Because the more you live with somebody, the more like you pick up like their habits and their traits. And... I guess. My eyes have gotten greener since I moved here. Yeah, they've gotten yeah more hazel. Like I noticed the other day, Julia was in the sun and it's like beaming at her, and like her eyes literally looked green. Yeah, they're definitely getting lighter. Mine get lighter like every year. So did my dad's. My dad's were like really really light. Oh yeah, his are light. His yeah. Like yeah. Yeah. They weren't when I was a baby. You know, progressively throughout the years, they got lighter and lighter. Oh yeah, here we go. Some Hagen Dazs. So they got a milkshake. Don't Dolce de leche, fire. So Can I try it? Oh, I don't know if you'll like it. My lip. Oh. Guys, we haven't, Julie hasn't kissed me in like a day and a half now because of my lip. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll get another show. It's good. I like it. It's me. Very caramel-y. That's what I like. Yeah, or if you say caramel -y. You guys say caramel or caramel? I don't even know how you would comment that. It's spelled the same way, so it doesn't matter. I don't even know how to answer that for you guys. <laughs> and I got a uh, cookies and cream. Very basic, but can't go wrong with it. They got these little plant faces everywhere. There's a bunch of them. In a little fish pond. So the girls want to go to a store. That store is six minutes away oh, yeah, yeah, as a walk. Out. To go across the entire mall, which is what we have to do right now to get over to the water park and like Nickelodeon area, it's a 12 minute walk. That's pretty wild. 12 minute walk just straight from here all, all the way across to the entire mall. Johnny is? Nah. Johnny was. Damn, I don't even have a kid and I already have dad jokes coming in. That's sad. Wait, that looks like a, a sad, like, demented hate. Oh my god. Yeah, we got the water park, Nickelodeon Universe, big snow, the rink. It's literally just straight down. We're just gonna go look at it. <laughs> I know, yeah, we're just gonna go check it out. I don't know if we're gonna do anything. I just wanna see it in person. Women go? Nah, this is where men go. <laughs> there you go again. <laughs> that is a unique store. Alright, this is a store Julia and Angela wanted to go to. What up? What's up, bro? How you doing, man? Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah, I don't think there's anything for guys in here, bro. It don't look like it. What? There's no yeah, guy stuff in here, right? Yeah, we no, go no. Yeah, we're, <laughs> we're gonna go there. He's just like walking around like, what do I do? I feel the same way. Joe and I are just like, yo, what do we do? There's no there's no guy section over here, so we just follow our girl around. I like your opinion on a lot of things, so. Yeah, true. I got a pretty good eye. Yes. Oh my God, yeah, that looks like shit. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. What is this? <laughs> 
<laughs> Oi, got him, mate. You, look, you're in like a safari right now. <laughs> You go on snake hunting. <laughs> this place is just called Kids. No, it's Cotton on Kids. Oh, okay. I didn't see that on the side. Right here, it just says Kids. So, wow. Yo, what it Marvel? What is it? No, the animal things. Oh, oh yeah, that's what you're talking about. Let's share one. You want to? This is how we can get to the water park. Fast. Yeah, we just all drive on one of these. <laughs> no, he's dead. Oh, he's debating it. <laughs> but then we gotta drive it back. Oh, we see, I see somebody up there using it. Do you have to drive it back? Yeah, yeah definitely. Like yeah. Okay. Yo, no way. They got a Walgreens in here. Grandma would love it. Coca-Cola bubble. It's got a Coca-Cola machine. Oh, I don't know. It's like a little lounge area. But this whole area just smells like straight sugar. It smells really good. That might be part of it too, the cotton candy section. Mini golf. Duncan. I found it. I know what it is. It's a Cinnabon. Cinnabon right here. Here's a Nickelodeon universe. Different attractions, different stage shows, character appearances. You can get your own slime kits. Toys R Us. Wait, didn't that go out of business? No, they're back in business now. They were. No way. They did, yeah. That was my favorite store as a kid. Yeah, same. Um, it's sugar, but wait, they got an Oreo cafe? I need to try it, bro. I need that. I should have got that one. That probably would have tasted better. You want candy? Yo, look at this. Is that jelly beans? Holy crap. Oh, That's insane. <laughs> I'm like a cancer. <laughs> wow. And then there's a the whole water park. <laughs> what? Are you supposed to sit on this? I'm, I'm confused. Yo, this is crazy. We're about to get some tickets to go on uh, one of the roller coasters. Just trying to decide which one we're going on right now. There's like three of them. There's this orange one right here. And then there's this purple one, which it seems like everybody wants to go on this one. But I really want to go on the green one because the green one goes all the way out of the building and then straight down. And there's a bunch of different like loops. That one looks the most fun to me. I think we decided to go on the purple one. So right here. Oh, you want to do that? Yeah, we'll hit that one after. <laughs> right there. That's what we're gonna do, it kind of spins as we're going on it. Yeah, the green one goes straight up and straight down. That looks sick. That's a uh, jellyfish swing. We're about to go on. There's like nobody here too. So they took my phone. I couldn't record. I'm sorry guys, I wanted to. It was actually a lot more fun than I thought it was. Both Joe and Angela were like freaking out the whole time. I'm sitting there dying laughing. You guys didn't like it? <laughs> Come on, Joe, let's go on the green one. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> the best part too is they they thought they had the good seat, but they were backwards the whole time, so they literally went down backwards on the drop. They couldn't see anything. Just going backwards the whole time. I know, I felt bad. Wow, this candy store is three levels. That's insane. Oh, I'm in heaven, bro. Look at all these Oreos. Holy crap. That's insane. But that don't look like a gummy worm. <laughs> Hey yo. Hey yo. What is that? I have to get a squishmallow. It's Mystery Squad. Wait, are they marshmallows? It's candy? I'm so confused. No, it's the puffer thing right there. Yeah, there's these little plush things, but are they edibles? No, they just smell. What's it say? Breakfast what? gummies? Breakfast gummies? That's so cool. <laughs> Gummy watermelon. Dude, this is insane. It just looks like a pre-workout. This Look. is what Julia was talking about, Squishmallows. Wait, was that like a candy version no, of it? It's a, no, this is a scented version. Scented? And it's a mystery, no, it's in it. Oh, um, okay. Dude, Giant this Hershey is, bar, this is $60. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> hey, that's something I would buy, 100%. Diet starts tomorrow, <laughs> that's me every day. That's really interesting, chocolate rocks. Do you just suck on them? <laughs> I guess so. Bro, I don't even know if you can consume this. <laughs> it's like an actual rock. Just a random urinal. Some toilet paper. With, is that Putin, bro? I think so. Middle finger lollipops. Isn't this You're number the, one. Isn't this from The Simpsons? Duff? Yeah. Yeah. This yeah, is 230 pounds of stuff. chocolate. Wow, that is a lot of rock candy. There you go, Julia. Yo, we should get this for Cody. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, it's mochi. Mango mochi, strawberry. Whoa, sour head. No, no way. way. You gotta get it. We'd love we gotta this. try this. We would love this. Wait, what's the. The blue? Yes. You don't even wanna see the back. There's black cherry soda. No, what? We have to get what? Oh, they got nutrition facts? Sugar. Yeah, we gotta try this. Oh my gosh, bro. Peach? Oh wow, and grape, I've never seen that. Skittles cotton candy. 
That's probably good. World's smallest Jenga. World's smallest Hot Wheel car. I swear, they have stuff I've never seen before. Candy popcorn made with Sour Patch Kid Bits. Butterfinger. That one probably tastes better, I assume. Muscle malt balls. Heavy carbs, mostly sugar, not vegan. One gram of protein. Oh my. Cheat day, diet starts tomorrow. Candy doesn't judge, bulk up, treat yourself. <laughs> Just the pink Starburst. They have Starburst cotton candy as well. Cherry and strawberry. The part I've been waiting for. The Oreo Cafe. I just had a milkshake, but I think I gotta get one of these. Caramel coconut? These are some squishy. Oh, you've had these? Oh my god. Yeah, they're amazing. Are dude. they good? Yeah, they're really good. Babe, have you Let's ever had them? them? Let's get them. I've never no, had they're them. great. Yeah. Let's do it. Like that good? Yeah, they're pretty good. They're so, it's so she is obsessed with these things. Wow, that is a big one. Hazel could lay on this. Look, that's giant. You could use that as like a pillow. What? Cats is it like little cats? Oh you know what God. this reminds me of? So you know the cat, the meme of the cat that would like beat through space? Yes. Yeah, that's what that no, looks like. Cat. Oh, is that Harry Potter? Oh, Made out of jelly cool. beans. That's all jelly beans. That's crazy. That must have taken forever. All right, I gotta see what they got on this menu, dude. Oreo brownie sundae, cookie dough sundae, cold brew, Oreo waffle sundae, Oreo milkshake, Oreo cheesecake. Really, really want the Oreo brownie sundae, but we're about to go out to dinner, and I feel I kind of feel like it's a little bit of an overkill. So I'm gonna go with the Oreo shake, and I can add in Oreo cream to it as well. So that's gonna taste really good. So the milkshake I had earlier, when I first tasted it, it tasted pretty good. The more I drank it though, it kind of just tasted like milk. I was watching, he added like a lot of milk to it. Didn't even really taste like ice cream. I'm hoping this one's a lot better. Julia's never had these before, so I got these for us. Oh, thank you. Yeah. What'd you get? I got a, a Oreo cold brew. Sweet. Wait, yeah, the bag is Oh, that's cool. I've also never had this, so I'm excited to have yeah, this. Yeah, no, they're good. I had them a lot as a kid. Is it good? It literally just looks like a shake. I feel like I'm gonna have a heart attack. Yeah, probably. <laughs> that and then food right after. Yeah, we get our desserts first. <laughs> first time. He likes it. I told you it's good. It's like a brownie almost, right? With like cream in the middle. Oh, that looks awesome. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah? That is rough. Would you describe it like how I said, like a brownie with a cream in the middle? Wow, that looks incredible. This is like 10 times more flavorful than what I had earlier. That's good. Not gonna lie, the first time I saw this, I thought it said poofy pop. But it says poofy pop. Yeah, my mind's playing games, but uh, interesting. Yeah, now I have a stomach ache. I drank that entire shake. Probably wasn't the best idea. In the moment, it was worth it, for sure. This is one mile long of candy necklace. You ready, babe? She got the soda and her little squishmallow thing. Okay. Oh, you can get Pez like that? I love Pez. Dude, I'd get so much of it. I always feel like I never have enough of it yes. when I open a little pack. Yeah. Oreo yeah. Cow Tow. All right, we gotta get out of here. We gotta head to dinner. It's gonna take like 20 minutes to walk across this entire mall to get back to the car. And we have like a 40 minute drive to dinner. Oh, she's God opening damn it. damn it. What? I got the exact one that I didn't want. Really? No. That's annoying. Why are you smelling it? Oh, wow, what are you gonna do with it? I it my sister. All right. Hey, I got you this gift. Oh, how nice sure, of you. She already knows that I got it. I can't believe you thought of me. Gelato. I don't want to look at any more sweets. I just want like a filet, maybe some pasta. Oh my God, there's an ice skating rink right here. Yeah, I was gonna say, my nipples are like piercing through my shirt. That's so cool. So many different fun activities you can do in just a mall. I'm not entirely sure, but I think we hit most of the mall today. Which is pretty dumb. We've been here like almost the entire day. It's been like five hours, which is a long time for me, at least for a mall. But why is there a baby diaper under your car? <laughs> so we're headed to the restaurant now. It's pretty dark, as you can see. Probably gonna eat and then head home. We're um, gonna get home tonight. Yeah, it's already like eight. Probably won't get out of here till like 10, get home by like 12. Hazel's gonna have to sleep in my grandma. Yeah, I'm crashing right now from the sugar. So hopefully this food wakes me up a bit. Yeah. We're gonna have to get an energy drink for the ride home. Sugary lemonade or something. Yeah, we bought that sugar drink. Oh, true. Oh, yeah. Wait, but it's not gonna be cold. Uh, oh well. Like a blue raspberry. Warheads. Warheads, yes. They have a whole Italian festival going on right now. Bands playing. Low down. Chicken tenders. Oreo funnel cake. Ooh. Yeah, it smells amazing. Deep fried Oreos. Oh my, I'm about to say screw the dinner. Let's get all this stuff. I smell like pastas and, oh, it smells so good. Italian ices. Probably my fave. Oh, we even got the bounce house. <laughs> yeah. Wow, he got the golden wings, dude. Oh Are you kidding? 
They are covered in 24 karat gold. Man's gonna be pooping out gold shards. It's on a split? Yeah. Does that taste weird? Do you even taste it? Does it taste like metallic? Dude, it's so not worth it. No, I bet. It's literally all for the presentation. Can you taste it? Does it taste like iron? Kind of. It's like it like comes off like a sheet. It tastes like cilantro. Ew, that's, <laughs> that's not good. It does taste like cilantro. No? Not good? Not worth it. Not worth it. Zero out of ten. All of your fingers. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Julia's gonna try it. This is so weird. It is very weird. Very weird. Weird? It's yeah. weird? What does it taste like? Does it taste like metal? Kind of like oh, cilantro, yeah. I mean, at least we tried them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it, bro. <laughs> Rocked up dinner. It was great. Just said goodbye. We're going to be headed back home now. We got about a two hour drive. Probably get home around like 12 31 ish. I'm tired. Can't wait to hit the hay. Same. That food is putting me in my. Right now. It is now the next day and annoyingly last night on our drive home I had two different maps pulled up I had one on my Tesla and I had one on my phone now The reason I had two pulled up was because my phone the maps were just messing up so much I added like 20 extra minutes to my ride because it was just not giving me accurate direction So I was like, all right, let's just pull it up on a Tesla as well So we did that the Tesla was giving us good directions And then we got to a point where my phone was telling me to get off a certain exit and the Tesla was telling me to just keep straight for seven miles quick thinking last minute decision. I was like, all right, I'm just going to keep straight. Yeah, that was a bad decision. I should have got off that exit because staying on that seven mile path, there was a ton of traffic ended up being a huge accident. And that seven miles ended up being 53 minutes worth of driving and waiting in traffic. So we didn't end up getting home until like almost 2 a.m. I was so exhausted. Julie and I passed out right away. I just thought that was a little funny story to tell you guys. But other than that, it's going to wrap it up for today's video. Cody is actually coming in this week to New Jersey. He's going to be staying here for almost two weeks. So of course we're going to be vlogging a lot for you guys. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you have my notifications turned on if you don't already. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.